have £250 there. Oh, look at the cushion you get. It instantly, as soon as you turn it on, it stinks of fuel. Morning. Morning. Today is a bit different. Rather than Alex telling you what the video is, we're going to go and tell him. What's he got on the driveway today? What do you reckon? Uh, Some BMWs? Almost certainly. Nah. <laughs> it's a 330D. He's just using it as a storage bin. What's under here? Oh, it's a shit box of some sort. All right. Hey, Macy. Morning. Macy. How are you? How's it going? Good. Good, good. to see you. Yep. <laughs> Slightly <laughs> apprehensive, excited. <laughs> okay. It's a really good start. So you have 250 pounds there. You also have eight hours. In that time, you have to source a car, buy the car, get down to West Wittering Beach. In that 250 pounds, you've also got to get buy the fuel to get you there. And you've also got to use that money to get three of us a barbecue. That doesn't include Jack though, right? Yeah, it does. <laughs> it has to have a valid MOT. Tax insurance aren't included in that, so don't worry, because that would be different for everyone. And it has to be rare. So if you've seen one in the last month, you can't get it. So immediately stuff like Fiestas, yeah, courses, yeah, yeah. Micros. micros. Okay, so immediate thoughts because I love looking for shitboxes. Yeah. Gumtree is your friend. eBay, sort by time ending soonest. Yeah. Facebook Marketplace. Jack, you're good at that because you're quite scummy. Auto Trader's going to be out because yeah. you can't really find anything for 250 quid. You're going to make tea. So you, Jack and I are going to look. Right, well, Jack, it is bang on 11 now. How was your uh, Facebook Marketplace head? It's okay, it's usually pretty good. I'll start with Gumtree, and if we don't find anything, then we'll go on eBay. If I find it on Auto Trader, you. Yeah. You okay, yeah, no, that's not going to happen. Fiat Punto 1.2 for £250, and it's literally just gone up for sale now. That's too, that's too common. This is the trouble with Facebook Marketplace. There is for sale a doll's head <laughs> Un <laughs> under cars. <gasps> Oh, no MOT. MG Convertible and oh, MGF. Oh, that would have been good. I like them. That I had, would have been I, sensational. I had quid. one of them. Terrible. How far is Essex? Essex? You, you don't want to go there. Oh, Daewoo. Daewoo. Not Daewoo. Light rear damage, MOT, 10th of the 2nd, 2020. 225 pounds. That already gives me 25 for fuel. Put in the maybe par. God, Facebook Marketplace is a minefield of just absolute nonsense. Suzuki Swift Devon, and that's like oh, at least three hours, oh, and then boy. you won't make it. It's TikTok, Alex. Jack, come on, you need to find me. Some I'm stuff. trying. You're literally of no help. Oh, how about a Freelander? Yeah, you see those every day. Subaru Impreza, two lit Impreza, two liter non turbo bug eye, four wheel drive. You're kidding me. I mean, it's in Lancashire though. MOT until 30th April next year. Has a few advisories and MOT needs sorted, but nothing major. Open to sensible offers. You know it says Lancashire. Lancashire. Oh, that's right, but this, this yeah. is a rude car though, so. Lancashire. Gun it. Far. What have you got the location set to? Far. I'm within 20 kilometres. So Jack's so far doing this properly. Yeah, but he's found nothing. Fair. Automatic Deu Nexia 1.5 GLXI. Windsor, that's Berkshire. Windsor's not far. 27,000 miles. MOT end October. Power steering, 295 or near offer. The tricky thing with this is you need to find someone that's going to be around to show you the car now. Ethan, guesses on how many Deu Nexias are left in the UK? 55. I'm going to go for 120. I'm going to go 30. 34 GLXIs, 5 GLI Autos, and only 9 GLIs. That's 49. That's quick, that's oh, oh, six up. Peugeot 306, when's the last time you saw a 306? I really like them as well. 306, two litre diesel, manual, four doors, MOT, August 2019, red, which means it's faster. No. Give me the tea. Get off. Ah! Did you want one, Jack? Yeah, well, yeah. They look cool, I like them. Oh, look at the cushion you get. And he's a pensioner, so he's going to be at home watching Countdown. Can I sit on the bike for the auto you can sit on the bike and do auto trader. I'm gonna find it. You just, you just wait. If you do, then I literally quit YouTube. I've got one. No, you don't. I do. What have you got? A Renault Scenic. No, come on. Please. Ethan, there's like five on my road. Skoda, it just says Skoda. Skoda Fabia, you're welcome. I do have something you might like. Uh, Volvo V40. You know, interestingly, the Space Star that we had last week, they share the same platform. Oh, really? Yeah. That looks really good. Wait, does it have MOT? Until August. And it's got full leather. Has he actually done it? Has he actually found a good no, car? No, surely not. That leaves me one pound for fuel and food. But you could probably get a tenner off it. We're going to be eating a pack of sausages and that's it, aren't we? That's definitely in the main part. That, I think that's top three. I think that could be. 
I think that, I hate him. Why did you say that? I think that could be the, like the best one so far, but I don't think he's going to budge on the price. Suzuki Wagon R. No. Yes. 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 Only the second gear doesn't work all the time. That's fine. You don't oh. need a second gear to get to West Withrow. I've got my list of favourites. I like the Deunexia, but I also like the Volvo. But well, I, I don't like it because Ethan found it. Yeah, that is really putting me off that. I'll phone up the Volvo guy, shall I? Because chances are I won't have it. What have you found, Jack? I've found lots of goodies in here. They're, uh, they're actually too good for this video. I'll probably just uh, keep hold of them, save them for enough time. Hi there, mate. I see that you've got a Volvo for sale. It's a Blue Estate for £249. Yeah, it's still available, perfect. If I were to come with 200 would that be okay for you? Right. ABS light is on, the speedo's not working. So if I were to offer you 200, you'd be all right with that? No, Okay, perfect, thank you very much. Thank you. Cheers, bye-bye. Yeah. Why did that have to go so smoothly? I should have gone in for 150. You should have. <laughs> Come on next year. Welcome. That's the thing, isn't it? If, if they don't pick up, then the car's pretty much automatically out. All right, we'll go 306 diesel. What if we end up doing this in like four hours? Well, that's good. We've proven that you can buy a car and go to a beach and have a barbecue with your friend, with your colleagues. Hi. Hi. With your best mates. <laughs> I see that you've got a Peugeot 306 for sale on Gumtree. Do you still have it? Hello. 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 Yes. Yes. Hello. Hello. Sorry? She's ready to uh, uh, sell 200 again. Two cars, two, two cars. potentials. 306 or the Volvo. I kind of want the Volvo though. I think we gotta look at it. Should we go to Miles? To the, the mi Miles. To the Miles mobile. <laughs> Right then, here we are, back in miles, with no air conditioning, with only two windows that work. It's just got one, so we've used 25% of our time. It is going to be tight. Oh god, I really hope that this Volvo's got aircon. If it does, it won't work. Not for £200. I actually, I can't deal with this heat. It's too much, and our ETA is basically about halfway in. Hopefully, the Volvo will be alright. As long as it drives in a straight line and stops, in a straight line, although cars that stop in a straight line are overrated, as we found out last video. Cool, onwards. Date with destiny, here we go. Here for a Volvo? Volvo V70, yeah? No, V40. Hello. He's there with the key and everything. Oh, there's an RX8. <laughs> oh God, we need another one of them. <laughs> right, so a lovely guy called Salim has just given me the key to the Volvo. There it is. <laughs> Looks all right on first inspection, doesn't it? I mean, to be honest, the challenge is to buy a car, take it to West Wittering. I don't really need to look it over very much, do I? Just as long as it starts and drives. Keep going, keep going, keep going. We've got about a quarter. What's that smell? It instantly, as soon as you turn it on, it stinks of fuel. Yeah, hazards work. Probably going to need them. <laughs> Nothing's on fire. Check to see if there's milky residue. That's all right. 94,666. <gasps> Windows go up. Look at that. Ooh. It doesn't look like it's going to fold in half or anything. Don't say it. I, I, think, you've, say I it. think you've done it. Ethan's done it. Don't give that to him. I'll try screwing down a bit more. One, seven, five. I'll try. All right, so you said 200 on the phone. Yeah. Can you go any lower, considering that, like, the more money I save, the more money I have like in fuel. That's the best we can do. 190. Disagree on 195. 195, yeah. oh you got me, okay. Right. 195 for a magnificent Volvo. Let's yep. do the let's do the paperwork. Yeah. There we go boys. Bought a car for 195 pounds. That leaves us with 55 pounds for fuel and food. This is a glorious moment. Mwah. Let us depart. £195, Jack. Right, whatever we do, don't let Ethan know that we like this car. No. If we gave him that win, his happiness would upset me. Oh, it's so smooth. The seats are glorious, aren't they? Oh, the way it changes gear like butter. Mwah. 
The steering wheel isn't even wonky. Who was you expecting it to be? I was expecting everything to be wonky. All right, so the speedo doesn't work. Should we see if the aircon works? That feels like aircon. That's cold. This is cold. Ethan, can you hear me? I can. I was just listening to Boris Johnson, our new Prime Minister. That's very exciting news, but we have more exciting news. The air conditioning in this 195 pound Volvo actually works. I'm pleased for you. Mine doesn't. Air conditioning doesn't work on my two and a half grand GTI. Your car's not worth two no, and a half grand. Yeah, no. This is what being a car enthusiast is all about. Recycling awesome old cars. What a find. Actually cut that bit out. I'm gonna stick to 20 quid. That's 35 quid for fuel. Food. I've gone over. Pucker. Nothing can go wrong. What's that light there? Shall we just not worry about it? I tell you what, I'm gonna put my phone in front of it to cover it. Now I can just see the ABS warning light. Shall we go on a money hunt? Oh yeah, good point. <gasps> so no, I think that might just be the cigarette lighter. That sounds like money. It does sound like money. 10, oh! 15, 16 pence. Shall we get any indication of miles per gallon at the minute? Well, does it have a uh, readout? Oh no, that's a rear wash wipe. Well, it's good that that works. Or in the trade, they call it a B-day jack. Oh, very nice. Get it? Wash, wash, wash. Yeah. There's one thing that's bugging me, Jack, and it's yeah. this disgusting steering wheel. It's colour. not very classy. I take it off. Oh, oh, I can hear that. <laughs> oh, that's so sticky. What's growing on it? Oh, look at that. Oh, what the smells it like? Oh. <laughs> Warning lights on dash. Poo on steering wheel. <laughs> Right, now it's time to go and get some food. I've got, how much have I got? 30 pounds, 30 British pounds. You can get a lot of food for that. So we're gonna go overboard. It'd be nice to come under. All right, yeah, maybe. Our ETA is about 20 past six, and we haven't done the shopping. I've got loads of time. Well... Loads of time. There's literally nothing that can go wrong. Should we do some shopping? Yeah. All right. All right. Did you go crazy? Yeah. It's quite a lengthy one. Why have you done that? I didn't mean to. Why have you done this? The woman at the till just kept on going until it went to 39 pounds. 39? 39 pounds. <laughs> but I got off the football. I've ruined it. Are we all going to share this one I ran juice? out of money. Why have you got a garlic bread? You put it on the barbecue. It's glorious. Where's the salad? I'm really hungry though, so um, at this point, I don't really care. <laughs> There we go. Should we get going? You've really f us, haven't you? You've gone over budget and you've pushed us right to the limit on time. I'm, I'm very sorry about that, Ethan. I feel terrible. I don't even hear any sincerity in that. Yeah, do you know what that is? It's because I'm being insincere. <laughs> <laughs> got a football. We're going to make it in time. Let's go to time. We'll get there at quarter to seven. Which gives us a massive buffer. We have made it. Hello, mate. How are you? I'll do that. <laughs> Miles, exactly, man, yeah. Good to meet you. It is now 18.54, so six minutes to seven. The challenge this morning was to buy a car for no more than 250 pounds. We've done it. As you can see behind me, West Wittering Beach, Job done. It's been an awesome adventure. It's been a fun challenge. Why are you shaking your head? You were eight pounds over with the I, parking for here I, as well. I may have been eight pounds over a little bit, but come on, you know, what's what's eight pounds between friend colleagues? Anyway, should we go eat? Let's go eat.
so it's the end of a really fun day. It's been a, it's been a good adventure, a very good challenge from you guys. Uh, unexpected, but we have proven that yes, you can buy a car for under £250. You can go to a place like West Wittering Beach. You can have a barbecue with your friends. I said it, no. I said your friends. Um, yeah, it's been awesome. How have you found it, Ace? It's been great. Yeah, it's been a really fun day. Yeah, Jack? Do this sort of stuff often. This is true. I'm impressed. I'm, um, I was sceptical. I didn't think you'd be able to do it, but we pulled it off. Oh, well, I mean, Ethan, Ethan found the car, which makes me really sick. Yeah. It was your idea to do this video. Maybe, um, maybe if this is a running thing, we have a scoreboard, so I'm wondering. No. <laughs> uh, <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh, anyway, if you want to see us do more adventures and more challenges like this, then uh, let us know in the comments. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel by clicking on this link. You can watch more videos from Car Throttle by clicking on this link. We will see you next time, so have a good day. Bye. Oh, they're burning. They're burning.